welcome to the vid. Uh, so today is Tuesday, my least favorite day of the week. We are in for a treat, I can just feel it. Work is gonna be super fun. Sense the sarcasm there? A little bit of it, just a little bit. Um, yeah, I feel pretty well rested though. I went to bed kinda early last night, so that was nice. I woke up, the birds chirping. It's nice being able to wake up with sun still shining because pretty soon it's gonna be dark when I get up, which is really sad. All right, I'm off to work. See me when I'm done. Today was, God, work is getting so difficult. I have so many projects. I'm leaving at 5.45, 45 minutes past my typical eight hour day, nine hour day. And I still didn't, ugh, there's so much to do still. I took a 10 minute lunch. I ate lunch at my desk. Um, yeah, so I gotta go home and finish editing a video. I want to enjoy work, but recently I have not been. I mean, it's never been that enjoyable, but usually I kinda enjoy my projects. I enjoy working with people I'm working with. However, a lot of my coworkers are quitting, or have quit, and I don't know. I gotta go home. I gotta go home and edit a video. Maybe try to go for another run. It's very humid though right now, so don't really wanna do it right now. Maybe I'll wait until it gets a little cooler tonight, but I'm also going out to a bar or a pub with friends to go say goodbye to David again for a surprise going away thing. I'm kind of excited about that, but I just, oh, uh, today is a rough day. I <laughs> My computer program crashed, so I lost about two and a half hours of work. That happened, and I don't have time for that. I don't have time for that. I might come in early tomorrow morning to start another project because this project has an ASAP deadline so we can get it to the printer so they can print 100 copies by the time of this conference. So, yeah. A lot of fun stuff happening here. I just finished editing my video, and it is now about mm, eight, eight o'clock, eight-ish. And I'm supposed to be at this thing for David at 8.45, so that means that I'm probably not going to go for a run. My hope was that I was gonna come home, edit a video, and go for a yog. But I unfortunately did not edit my video quick enough. I also had some chips when I got home, some chips and salsa. So that kind of delayed my video editing, which delayed my running. Yeah, I'm not gonna run today. Oopsie. And I am waiting for Casey. Casey is going to drive me to Stubborn Herbs because, I don't know, saving the planet, I guess. And we're gonna go say goodbye to David. So sad. All my friends are getting old. <sighs> we're old. Sad, sad day. He's going to grad school and I am just gonna keep doing what I'm doing, I guess, until something exciting happens. Until then, though, I'm just gonna keep doing life. What am I talking about? I am talking in circles. I am so weird. Look who it is. Hurry, Look hurry, who hurry. it is. We're gonna be late. Hurry. It starts you know, in 10 minutes. I mean, we're supposed to be there in 10 minutes. He's supposed to get there at 9, I think. I don't like being late. Me neither. I think I've been here twice in my life. Really? Oh. Off to Sturb, Stubborn Herbs. Apparently this used to be the stopping grounds before. The older people. My uncle's like, have you ever been to Stubborn Herbs? I'm like, uh, oh, yeah. Oh, well, kill the king on Thursdays. I know, and I've never done it. Yeah. I'd like the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't need any of that. We're all waiting for David. David's coming to Sturb. There's a lot of people here, a lot of people I don't know. No singing. No singing. You can sing happy birthday if you want to. Brian gets a solo. Brian's gonna sing happy birthday. It's not his birthday. Okay. Is this going on your vlog? Yeah. You haven't been out in a while, have you? Not since high school, probably. Oh my god, they're right there. Suck! <laughs> It's okay, he knows we're here. He does not know. Well, he's looking in the window. Anxiety, anxiety much? <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> Look who it is. The hack daddy. Does everyone play that anymore? I'm the only one that calls him Hack Daddy. It's kind of weird, maybe it's not bad. Alright, the Rocky surprise was a success. Uh, everyone yelled, you know, when he came in the door, and that's what happened. So now everyone's just chatting. It's like a little reunion. I haven't seen anyone in a while. There was cake, too. Alright, haven't been to one of these in a while, have you? No, no, I haven't. So, David's thing was good, but it wasn't enough, so now we're going out. 
Yeah. Happy birthday Tuesday. Make it look better. All right. Yeah, I make it look better. Check out the new ride. <laughs> I get to sit in the front seat this time. Before I couldn't. Before I was in the back seat, which is actually a lot bigger than my back seat. That was dumb. Okay. <laughs> that was dumb. <laughs> <laughs> that was fucking dumb. I do that all the time. Okay, um, the bar was fun. It was a little better this time because I was with other sober people. Yeah. Last time I went to Birthday Tuesday, it was me and Josh. And Josh drank quite a bit, and I did not. And everyone we were with drank quite a bit, and I was just sitting there looking at, oh. Two years ago, I would have had the time <laughs> of my life, 21 again. But now that I'm not, that kind of activity is un, uh, uncondoned. No, it's not. You can't uh, do that, you can't do that. Going home now. This guy's driving. I'm driving. In his, his nice, pretty nice ride. Yeah. That he's gonna get to drive for a few more months. What did I have? And he'll leave. Like, Wait, how long are you gone for? Three months. Three months. That's not too bad. No. Then I come back and I drive it to deployment. What happens after? Okay, yeah. What happens after that? And then I got four years of on base deployment. Four years. Yeah, and then one of those years is out on the sea or on the sea on the boat. Yeah. yeah. Pretty cool, they call them boats, even though they're like mega boats. fortresses. Boats. But, my yeah. mansion on the water. It's just my boat. My boat. I'll write you a letter. Thanks, man. You have to give me an address, though. <laughs> uh, the boat. <laughs> the <laughs> I, boat. I don't know. Can you get mail? I don't know if I can. You have to be able to get mail, though. I can disclose the location of the boat. To but a, I feel like you could just give it to the general location. Yeah, or I'm guessing you'll just send it to like the military, the U.S. Can, Navy. Yeah, the Navy school. will give it to you. Yeah, I, hopefully. We'll figure I'd it like out. To be able to talk to other people, but. You never know. You'll make other friends. Yeah. I was just, a, I was just a bump in your road. You know, it's yeah. fine. Yeah. yeah. You're just a little, a road, a little <laughs> road bump. A little pebble in the pebble An in the lake. To <laughs> An obstacle to your real life. You know, like <laughs> that's what I am to you. It's fine. All right, I have made it home. Uh, Alex dropped me off, and I think my roommates are sleeping, but they left all the lights on. Josh does this all the time. I don't know why. It's okay though, because we don't pay for the electricity, but like, come on, shut the lights off, you know? Here we go. Made it back to my room. I am very tired. However, it's not even that late. It's 12 o'clock, and I mean, <laughs> I said in the other video, 11 o'clock was early, so 12 o'clock is pretty normal, a pretty normal bedtime for me, so I'm just gonna go to bed at midnight and call it good and wake up at seven tomorrow morning and go back to work. Actually, might set my alarm for a little earlier so I can get to work early because I have so much stuff to do at work. I'm working overtime to get stuff done. I'm not paid by the hour though, so just doing my job, I guess. Anyway, I am off to bed, so remember, do what's right and you will see me tomorrow.